Perfect. Um, all right. Oh, I'm, my dumbass just walked outside. Welcome back <laughs> to the next episode of the Warlock Challenge. I'm, of course, joined with the one, the only Q, the Costa Rican. Yo, what's good, everybody? How y'all doing? I had a kids. Tell me in the comment section down below, is Lapras the best water type ever? Because I think so. I think Lapras is overrated. Piece of sh All right, anyway. Um, <laughs> I bet you do. Oh, man, that was that was intense battle. If you guys did not see the last episode, you guys, what the hell are you doing watching this shit? You need to go watch that Warlock over on Q the Coast Recent channel because that war match was intense. But now, it really was. all paths end here because we're headed into <gasps> our friggity dickin uh 6v6 match coming up after we beat the ghost type gym leader i believe i have and no idea who the fourth gym leader is but yeah it is after it is after that fourth gym that's all i know yeah it's the the little scary kid that has the mask um we gotta beat him and after we do that then me and q will embark on a 6v6 battle and any pokemon that faints in that 6v6 is dead yes sir so it's going to be a friggity fracking doozy so basically, we're so, out here trying to 6 0, essentially. That's so really not, what it is. I refuse to lose another Pokemon after the first battle. I refuse. Yeah. That's the, that's <laughs> that's the goal here. Oh, dude, yeah, we have so much stuff to do before that bat, that gym battle. Yeah, I'm pretty mm. sure because, like, right now, there's a lot of dialogue we're talking. I don't know if you're talking to the gym leaders right now, but I am. I just got done with that. Oh, shit. Are we about to battle bead right now? Oh, no. Hop's about to battle bead, and Hop's about to get freaking wiped. Was that what happens? Yeah. Spoilers? I actually don't yeah. remember. I don't remember anything about playing this game, like playing through this game, because like when it when I first played it, like mm -hmm. I literally no life it, bro. Like I I played it for like ten hours straight and then beat it like a few hours later. Um, it was crazy. The first ever time I played it, I did a Nuzlocke. Oh, he's back in the wild area. The uh, second time I played it was doing the the oh. four way cage match. Hey. Is that over? It's over, bro. Okay, like, that you guys recorded Christmas that like last Eve. fucking year, and bro. We fi we started out. filming that shit this time last year. Yeah, and, and like episodes are still coming out. Is what I'm saying. Um, the last episode aired uh, December 24th. Jesus Christ, dude, that's hilarious, bro. It How, was why long. did it take you guys that? Why did it take you guys that long? Like it, there was yeah. we had an issue. So uh, we had one guy that had to drop out because. The coronavirus was hitting, and they were trying to, like, jam-pack the, like, ass into that school year in. Okay. So, because we started recording January, and so they were, like, coming off a, a holiday break. Yeah. And uh, they were like, hey, this is what we're going to do. So he's like, oh, shit. So he had to hurry up and get his school stuff done, and that kind of, like, put a damper on things. And then, um, to be fair, though, there was, there was a good chunk of time where we could only record like one oh my fucking god one episode a day yeah but like you guys like you had like you had the whole series for like months and then and you know what i mean didn't you we like, wasn't that what you were, you were telling me that before right right we essentially finished um we essentially finished uh probably the close to the end of that summer with it we had a lot of the episodes but getting them edited was like a freaking nightmare really because... i feel like it wouldn't be that hard you just got to sync up four audios and that's that's what so that's what the the weird thing was is because there was like a everyone kind of edited a little bit differently if that yeah. makes sense yeah no i get it so it was kind of like all over the place you son of a gun i swear to god if you have a barrier i'm gonna be pissed like you guys didn't do the whole yeah we kind of one thing we, we yeah we kind of slept on that and we didn't do the we didn't really um so how the fuck did you even sync it then you just ran like ah, i hope it works like you just like we so there was a we had one audio file that had everybody's voices on there oh so you guys are using discord then correct we had like uh... a we had like a pretty good one that had everyone's voices recorded and that was where we were trying to like match an ad and then we had a couple we ran into a few issues as far as like um hey uh your audio in the in the four way chat sounds way better than your audio does in the actual group chat. What are we gonna do about it? <laughs> so well, man, at least you didn't have to deal with face cams, right? You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. That was, I guess, that's the silver lining. But damn, I could not, I could not use Discord audio because it sometimes sounds good, but it usually sounds really bad. Just couldn't do it. Not for a whole series, anyways. For like a one off video, easy. Like if someone's just hanging out on call, you know what I mean? That's, you know what I mean? That's easy. Right. But damn, bro, I couldn't do it with the four people. Jesus. 
It was it was pretty tough, man. It was pretty tough. Um, that was probably one of the one of the uh, longest projects I've been a part of, and definitely one of the hardest to edit and to just get everybody together because a lot of it was too because it took so long to uh, get edited. Yeah, I know. I know. Like trying to get four people's schedule lined up is kind of crazy because yeah. I know Goki. He was in school at that time. I'm pretty sure, and he yep. was doing dance, dance stuff. Yep. Like, yeah, and I I know Gio was in school as well. So that's yeah. Mm-hmm. I couldn't even I couldn't even imagine trying to schedule, trying plus, to even trying to schedule that. Plus, at that time that we started doing that, I didn't have a schedule. I was like, "Hey, bro, this is what we're doing today," and we're like, "Oh shit, hey, you're gonna be you're gonna be out in the field for 16 hours." Yeah, you're so on like, you're on call or something or what? Yeah. No, oh, okay. Pay to order. Oh yeah. No, I had some investigations to do that I had to mm. be like on standby for a majority of the the day. Well, I'm in Hammerlock. Did you? I ran into a level 40 uh, Pokemon to battle. Better hope you have a fucking Poke doll. And uh, I beat him. <laughs> and I just got everybody up to level 16. Oh, wait, what? You beat him? With who? Yeah, with a uh, War Turtle. How? <laughs> oh, okay. I don't want to. Um, I did. So I did uh, Fire Fang with my Charmeleon. Okay, he got Fire Fang, got it. And then, uh, taking notes, and then uh, <laughs> dropped yep. him down a little bit, and then he used Takedown into my War Turtle, and then War Turtle tanked the, like, it took the hit from Takedown really good, and That's then um, well. knocked his ass out with, uh, gosh diggity darn, uh, War Turtle's uh, Scold. Nice. I just won the game with this Pokemon Evolving. Did you? Yep. Did you now? It's already over. I will let you know, my Swedish friend. I can't believe this man really mm. thought he was going to do something with a Lycan Rock. That's all I want to know. What was he thinking? I really can't believe there? this man double protected and did it. And got it, right? And got it. It's just because I trained my Pokemon well, you know? They're your, they're your friends. That's our difference. Yeah, Pokemon yeah, are yeah. tools for power. F- funny, funny thing is, last episode you literally said my Pokemon are my friends. Not and anymore. What happened? Not, not they anymore. Fucking they let failed me down. you. I don't need friends. I need glory. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna I start hope you enjoyed like, the first one. Like I hope I'm you enjoyed general. the first one because never again. You only get one. I, that's all I need. I'm just gonna start whacking their heads off as soon as we get into that six v six, man. Yeah, that's what you say, but okay, brother. I'm start knocking them out, <laughs> man. Oh, if you, man, you, man, you, you gonna hope that I don't find items that I need? Because if I could find this item that I need, it's literally over for you. It's like that's actually fine. over, actually over, actually. That's over. fine. So it's gonna be crazy. Wait till I find this item, bro. Some of y'all, some of y'all out there might know what item I'm looking for, but I doubt it. Cause it's this item, bro. It might not be in. I don't think it's in this town at all. I don't think there's anything in this town that I need. Super repel. That wasn't the item. Super ripple. <gasps> nah, I don't need that. Sh- we two hyper potions. I'll take those though. Do we just progress now, or what? I think so. Hold on. Where's the? Where's the freaking? There's usually a flag somewhere, right? On the D of the old map. Oh, I think I'm supposed to go into Hammerlock Stadium and, like, get a tour or some stupid shit. Yep, I am. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's what we're supposed to be doing. Yo, this Rhydon is fighting a Gastrodon? You're gonna fucking lose, buddy. It's a <laughs> Gastrodon. Not. It's a Man, Gastrodon. Rhydon has Does, surf. Rhydon don't know... Okay, Gastrodon's literally <laughs> immune to it. So what are you talking about? He's got surf. It's okay. He, he's got, Rhydon, Rhydon's, got, Rhydon's got grassy knot. You think so? I don't really don't think he can. What if Rhydon got grassy oh, glide? snap. Yo, fan, I'm not even going to tell you about this, but this is some good shit right on, and I'm, that I stumbled upon right now. I know where the focus sash is in there. That's not even what we're looking for. Oh, yeah. We're doing this. But who else, though, is the question. I'll let you uh... No one, I guess. That was a wasted move. All right, well, whatever. Yeah, it was wasted. Don't worry, I'm gonna catch up. Yeah, you think so? You can't catch up, Phantom. You like, on, actually, if you won the six v six, you'd catch up. Yeah. Yeah, in terms of like score. 
Oh, yeah, because yeah. it's, well, it's 4 2 right now. Yeah, I'd be. It, honestly, I think that unless you sweep me with like the first two mons that you bring out, then that's you have where a it's going to be it. I think you got a good chance. I'd love to see it because you saw I, you saw some of my Pokemon already. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I took notes. I got, I got a notebook right here. I'm glad got, you're like, taking notes. Glad on and your all demise. their attacks. That's what's gonna happen. You're gonna lose, Phantom. I can't lose. I was scouting for the first match. Ever since That's then, I lost. haven't lost. I'm just saying. For the first match. Although I'm really mad mm -hmm. that I lost in DD Solasis, but it's okay. You know, I should. I should, yeah. I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking back then. Oh, he wants to go to Route 6? Alright, cool, 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 cool. You would count. This is, this is straight up just the, uh, the old, um, just a bunch of story episode. Mm-hmm. Like, the story in this game sucks, if I'm being honest. Yeah, I'm not too, not too thrilled. My fan but, game's gonna be way better. You think so? You wanna hear the synopsis? Sure, go for it. Um, it is a region that has its own legendary Pokemon. That's going to be the only fake Emon in the entire game is going to be the legendary Pokemon. I feel like Pokemon. you've told me about this before, but, but go again. Maybe it changed. Um, yeah, it's going to be the only legendary Pokemon in the entire game. Okay. Right? And it's going to be, that's the only fake Emon. A true legendary. Correct. And uh, it is an entire uh, region that is man-made, and it's Ooh. built on an island that has every biome a Pokemon can need there. That's pretty cool. And it is, it takes, um, kind of think of, uh, you know how like a non-native species gets introduced into other regions? It's because yeah. people visit places with these Pokemon, with these creatures, and they yeah. introduce them by accident yeah. or on purpose. Yeah. It's called an invasive and, species, right? Correct. Yeah. And that Some adopted is, them. that's kind of like the synopsis of this island is that this island is like an area for Pokemon to. It's like think of like a uh, an ultimate safari zone in a way, where okay. people just bring Pokemon there. They drop them off. They they just live there. Um, they have all these biomes. Whatever suits that Pokemon, they they have areas for them. That's pretty cool. Um, I like it. Now, one of the the other good things about the region is that everybody in the region is it loves Pokemon. There's no like serious cruelty going on. Everybody is competitive. Um, everybody is like hey man when they battle like they're trying to win there is yeah. no i'm trying to teach you a lesson it's no dude i'm trying to end your career yeah so like me going against you in 2v2s yeah which ain't happening again um <laughs> but if uh yeah that's kind of kind of like the whole thing every every trainer you're gonna battle is gonna be like oh this guy actually has a team like for this, like you're gonna run into like rain dance teams. You're gonna run into, you know what I mean. Oh, that's And a lot cool. of the battles are gonna be double battles. That's pretty cool. So, it like I, I want to make it as competitive as possible, and then I will spoil. I'll spoil this. When you get your starter Pokemon, right? It's gonna go. The dialogue's gonna go like this. Hey, your parents left you, left you a Pokemon. Can you guess what it is? Ah, so you get to select two starters, basically. Correct. That's pretty fine. And, and then, whenever you pick the first one, it goes, um, all right, so it goes, oh, for example, oh, Charmander's your starter. Okay, guess what Guess what nature it is. Oh, really? So you get to just do all that? That's actually guess, pretty fire. Guess what ability it has, and then you That's pick all of it. Cool. That's pretty cool. That's actually yeah. crazy. Yep. So, like I'm going to have, I'll like, all that laid out, so I, I just want it to be as, that. as like, because the, the story for the main character is his parents are actual, like, Pokemon trainers, like, they freaking, that's what they do. Yeah. So. It's pretty cool. That sounds dope. Sounds new and fresh. Pokemon would never do something like that. No. They ain't smart enough. <laughs> uh, they just recycle the same, used up Wants to destroy the world story and fucking, you know, just adds a different Pokemon to it. Yep. But it's what keeps making them billions, so, you know, why change a formula that works, you know? Yep. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yo, I could get a fossil now, even though, you know, we already have our army. And we can't yeah. get we can't do it, but I could if I wanted to. If you wanted to. You got the you got the the water dragon. 
Bro, I hate how... Like, they have you in this, like, what looks like it's gonna be a 2v2. Like, you're hanging out with your boy Hop, and you fight... Oh my god, they're level 29. And you're fighting these, uh, <laughs> these guys, you know, mm -hmm. that are two people, two of us. Let's do it. But no, they don't wanna. They ain't down. Oh, this boy about to sweep. <gasps> Sick dodge, bro. Let's go, kids. How you doing? How to kids? Sun boosted flare blitz. Oh, oh my out of here. Atlanta. Yeah, I actually flare blitzed your reboot slot with my Incineroar. And never, you know, because you one shot at me somehow. Minus one attack, still one shot in Incineroar. It's kind of wild. It's because Dunk, Duncan don't play, man. I mean, he's he, right. He's dead. So you don't yeah. play. He dunked into the... Yeah, right. He dunked and took a fucking dive in front of Lapras twice. <laughs> yeah. Um. The other thing about the freaking game that What's I want to say. So you have all that stuff. And then I also made it to where whenever you leave the first town, that you can travel to any town that you want to battle first. Oh, okay. So, what's, the, what's the significance of that? Is it all the same, or is it? I want like, I want the person to have like freedom of exploration. Yeah. Like, um, it really got to me whenever I watched uh, Pokemon Generations. You remember that? Uh, yes. And then you learn that gym leaders actually have, um, yeah, entire... separate teams for separate levels and stuff. Correct. Yeah. yeah. So you know, they was like, oh, well, since you're a starter trainer, I'm gonna use these two Pokemon, right? Well, Evolution if, time. Sorry to cut you off. Yeah, no, Go no on. problem, no problem. Go on. I'll let you. I'll let you have your hype train. Yes, sir. Um, my thought was, uh, what if a what if a trainer is you know not from that town? What if they're from somewhere else? Like their first gym wouldn't be this gym; it would be that gym. You know what I mean? So, did or I, I if your starting Pokemon well? is weak to this gym here, well, shoot, you go to another gym. Start there. Ah, uh, okay. I see what you're saying. I see what you're um, saying. That's pretty cool. I like that. It's gonna have the same where Pokemon will disobey you. Yeah. For course. sure. Because that'll prevent just people from just grinding up. But the entire region, the Pokemon levels are gonna scale to you. So I'm trying to figure out a way how to code it to where the Pokemon around the, the place, like the wild Pokemon, are gonna match the trainer's level. If you want the them to match, then yeah, you, you just have... Like, I don't, I'm obviously, obviously not a coder, but you'd have to do, like, if... If and, right? If and mm -hmm. only? Yeah, that's what you'd have to do. Right. And then just have it and then just have the X X be the uh your trainer's current level. Mm-hmm. I know a little bit about coding, but definitely not a lot not enough. Yeah, I'm gonna have to Ooh. But his fake out on Incineroar literally does so much damage. Like why is why is a fucking base base forty power move just knocking things out? Crazy. He's fast. Going faster makes it stronger. Yeah, this bitch hit five times with the fury swipes. Damn. That mm. should hurt. That could help, but I don't need that anymore. I can't believe he evolved and died. I'm sad. <laughs> I can believe it. Bro, if I would have just bought Rillaboom to that match, I'd have won even faster. Like, that's mm -hmm. crazy to think that. But I didn't want to waste, not waste him, but I didn't want to use him in a 2v2 yet. Like, because there's 2v2 yeah. scenarios where he literally could just win. <laughs> are like you... What's up? Are you, uh, worried? About? If I'd have won that, would you have been... If I'd have won that 2v2, would you have been like, oh, shit. No, like, honestly, like, when we first... When, like, I saw Team Preview, because of the Lycanroc, like, you always could have won, won that. Because Lycanroc's not, not, that, not that slow, but also not that fast. Mm -hmm. It was faster than my Incineroar and my Lapras. Mm. So like yeah like you you and like yeah if I wouldn't have got the double protect you would have got it. So you know it comes down to the RNG. Yep, that was crazy. Like I said, if you guys did not see the war match, you guys need to go watch that because yeah. you just got spoiled of it. But it's okay. Go back and watch it anyways because the reactions were hype. Phantom was I think Phantom threw his desk. I did. I threw my hat. <laughs> like Leon does. Oh yeah. <laughs> No, I said. Oh I didn't no, throw my Opal's beer. next. I think. No, can't be. Yeah, we just well, we just met her. Yeah, but she goes back to her fairy village. You don't think Opal's next? Oh yeah, the fairy's after the forest. So never mind. Yeah, you're right. Oh, this is the ghost one. Yeah. 
I'm not ready for the ghost one, bro. We could literally do this right now, I think. But I'm not ready. Bro, you made it all the way there? Holy fuck. I'm not there yet. I'm on the route. But, like, still. You know? I don't want to use you. I'm gonna I was use, about I'm gonna to say, you. man. I'm fucking... I'm not ready for the ghost gym because I have got to fucking grind up a team. Bro, the ghost gym is the first 6v6. That's crazy. Yeah. Oh, I'm scared for the ghost gym, to be honest. Actually, no, I'm not. I got in center, boy. The fuck am I saying? And of course I'm bringing him to the 6v6. I'd be stupid not to. Mm. What do you think so of uh, Rainier? Who? What, what the fuck's his name? The dragon gym leader? Rayhan? Rayhan. Oh, he's cool. Takes selfies. Cool guy. He doesn't have dragons, but whatever, you know. Well, you yeah, know. his entire team should be fucking dragon. I don't get it. Yeah. That was stupid. It's, it's literally fucking Torkoal, Gigalith, Flygon, and then fucking mm -hmm. Turnback Turtle. Forgot his name. I will say they did they did shake it up a little bit by uh, doing the whole, you know, TV2. Like, the, po the, the support Pokemon helped his dragons. Well, yeah. Not really, though. Like, Eerie Spell. What does that do? Didn't he have a team of six though? Oh my god, got rid of my people. He had, he had but, fucking. Like, the thing, the thing about that is like, uh, what was I gonna say? Like Gigalith set the sand for Flygon. Flygon doesn't get Sand Rush or Sand Veil. He oh yeah, levitate. that's so fucking stupid. That should be. He gets le yeah, he gets Levitate. Like that's it. It doesn't. It didn't do anything for Flygon. Levitate doesn't even help. Like he gets hit with a ground move. It's like, oh okay. I mean, it's cool for like not hitting T spikes and stuff like that. But like, yeah. It's really not much of uh, anything else besides like a, a random uh, ground immunity, mm -hmm. but I don't know. It's just it's just weird. Like the sand literally doesn't help any of his Pokemon. <gasps> Another evolution, motherfucker, bro. I need to sand fix. like literally doesn't help in my opinion. But yeah. what do I know? Did you represent Butter Cahoots by bringing an Ice type? Well, Lapras. Oh, now yeah, word. You saw God. it. God damn it! I should have killed it. <laughs> you couldn't have. Well, too well trained. Yes, yeah, that's true. It's skilled at both offense and defense, and it gets pumped up when cheered on. But if it oh. starts showboating, it could put itself in a tough spot. Stronger, better, faster, stronger. Oh, let's go, kids. Let's go. Let's actually go. We mm. won. We won, Phantom. It's over for you. It's over? Yeah, I think it's actually over for you. It's fine. I ain't even worried about it. Send a competition. You should be. You should very be worried. It's ain't a competition. This ain't a competition. It's a war. <laughs> it's the definition of competition. It's a goddamn war, bro. No one comes out alive. What if the old lady was your was your tag partner in the double battle? What old lady? Though you remember the old Opal? lady with the team, the yell grunts. I mean, I'd I'd hang out with her. Yeah, I seems like a cool gal. Too. Okay, so this Hippopotas has Sandstream, but it's sunny in this area. Hippopotas. I got fucked up by Hippopotas. And I, that video actually goes up today. Yeah? Yeah. How, how do you like your Soul Link, my man? Axu. Bro, the Soul Link is honestly, like, I know I'm on your channel right now and we're doing another collab, <laughs> but that has arguably been, like, my favorite collab thus far. I've only done three. Really? Counting, okay. Yeah, like, counting this one, I've only done three uh, that, that I want to count because the other ones aren't finished. They never finished. Right. Uh, everyone ditched me. Mm. But... So we got the first Soul Link with Butter Cahoots, was what, which was, you know, more or less, you know, a trial run. My first ever collab, official collab. And it was fun. It was a good time. You know, Cahoots and I right. connected a lot, and we had a good time. Um, and then, yeah, the Soul Link was just, like, it's, it, like, we recorded the first 12 episodes within two days. Like, we on Christmas Eve, we recorded six episodes, and then Christmas, we recorded six episodes. Jeez. So, like, just hanging out with that man for, like, like what, I think six hours at a time? Like, it was, it was just... I don't know, man. It was just so fun. It was a good time, and we like talked about everything and anything. And I don't mm -hmm. know, it's like it's like a memory I always have now because it happened on Christmas Eve. You know what I mean? Like I couldn't right. forget it if I wanted to. You know what I mean? So it's just, it was just yeah, fun. That's what's but up. it was just fun. But like, uh, you know, there's a lot more collabs to be had in the future. So I can't wait for all that to happen. But yeah, Soul Link so far has easily been my favorite collab thus far. Nice. But this Warlock this. has been picking up fucking steam, dude. Like, ever since the the second G uh, war match, ever since I lied to you in the Isle of Armor, like, yeah. this 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 uh, this series has low-key been kind of hot. I will <laughs> say this, though, Q. Um, collabs that you are teammates 
are always going to be better That's than true. collabs that you are enemies. That's true because like we have to like me and you have to lie to each other like we're, mm-hmm. we're you know like we're anti gassing each other up. Like right. I literally can't I can't even help you with like if you're in, it's stuck in the nuzlocke because oh, like we got to freaking level up. We got a v- evolution. I didn't cut you off but <laughs> <sighs> no, you're good man. But yeah, like so I know what you mean. I know what you mean. 100%. Yeah, when you're when you're working together, you're always gonna be more. And I'll say I'll tell you this, Q. Me and Dylan have have only done one project where me and him were actually enemies. What was, was that a rival lock? The rival lock, right? Yeah, that was the uh, that was the go lock, man. With let's go Pikachu, let's go Eevee. Well, no, you did a cage lock with him too, didn't you? So, yeah, it, I mean, we called it. The, all right, so this was this is what we did, um, because let's go Pikachu, let's go Eevee has no held items, right? Right. What we did was a go lock where every we had a we had battles and it was um one v one Pokemon in the quote unquote cage match and uh if you won that you got a go token which allowed you to to add a Pokemon from Pokemon Go. Oh that's fire. Yeah, so like uh Dylan, for example, he won. He added his shiny uh Charmander and got a shiny Charizard. Um, in me, I added No Name, which is which was a Dratini that I caught that I turned into a Dragonite. So, so if you won the cage match, what are you saying? Like that was the perks instead of everything else, right? Because it so was it's... still the still the same rules were first Pokemon on the route. So yeah, you're limited. You you were limited to the first Pokemon on a route, and you know let's face it, because you can't you couldn't randomize. Let's yeah. go back. Yeah, then. yeah, 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 yeah. You were getting trash. But but did you guys allow like TMs the whole thing or? Yes, yes we did. Oh, so okay, okay. So you did you switch up the rules quite a bit. So, but so that's the incentive cool. was to get the Pokemon from Pokemon Let's Go or from Pokemon Go, because then you could really choose who you wanted. Yeah, that makes sense. So what I added, freaking Meltan to my team. Uh, well, you couldn't get a Melmetal ever. Right back, yeah, Melmetal wasn't even a thing. Then they had to have a whole another update. Um. Well, no, I mean, like, even like, no, like you transfer Melton into your game, you can never right. Yeah, I couldn't evolve. Yeah, back then though, no one even had a Mole Metal. Oh yeah, that yeah. was like literally Pokemon Go, right before Let's Go dropped. It was like, oh, here's Meltan. What is this thing? What does it do? I remember that. So, I remember those days. That was the uh, that was the whole whole shebang with that. And I remember uh, grinding on Pokemon Go just so I can have a Mole Metal. Yeah. To use. To have and to hold. Forever and for always. Do I one shot this thing? I wanna say yes. But um yeah. Yes, counter, I lose. But I'll say our our friendship dynamic definitely changed during that battle. During that that series. Series? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like for good, right? For the good? Yeah, oh definitely, because it, it definitely like uh we earned each other's respect because like in, in when you typically are teammates and especially in like soul links and shit, like you yeah. really rely on your teammate to keep that Pokemon that you're like connected to alive you know what i yeah. mean yeah so yeah so like tell me about it yeah you have a freaking legendary and you know it may be equipped it may be partnered with like a really shitty pokemon so you're like hey man you have got to protect this shitty pokemon because this is like my whole team right here yeah and or or your soling partner just grinds by himself off screen with your favorite pair and loses it you know something sometimes that happens oh fuck <laughs> oh that's kind of crazy yeah sometimes that happens Man, I'd be. I tell you what, man. I'd tell that partner that he can go kick rocks. Or I'd yeah. say, hey, what's your favorite team? Oh, he's dead. My bad. Nah, I don't self sabotage like that. Nah. But here's the scenario, right? I'll tell you the scenario since we're almost okay. over with this episode, anyways. Cahoots, like, so EJ and I had just got done filming Soul Link, right? Mm-hmm. About an hour later, uh, Cahoots hits me up and says, yo, you want to play some Apex? I'm like, hell yeah, let me go hit up EJ. I'm like, yo, EJ, you want to play some Apex? And he's like, ah, I can't. Gotta go to sleep. And I'm like, all right, you gotta go to sleep. You know what I mean? You gotta go to sleep. I understand that. You need to, you know, you're, you're tired. And then, about 30 minutes in, Cahoots and I play in Apex, this man messages me, says, oh, hey, by the way, Juicy's dead. You don't know who Juicy is, that's why I said Juicy. Um, uh, yeah, he says Juicy's dead. And I, I drop my controller, I start fucking saying, what the fuck? And Cahoots like, what's wrong? And I tell him the story. And he's like, are you serious? And I fucking chewed into this man, EJ. Like, for one, we invited you to play Apex, and you didn't mm-hmm. want to come. Like, what the fuck? And instead, you chose to grind by yourself. Like, without us. Like, what the fuck? Like, it's st- like what? I didn't understand it. Mm. But then he explained to me how, like, he shares a room with his brother, and his brother was sleeping, so he obviously couldn't play a game while his brother's sleeping, especially a game like Apex that, that 
definitely a lot. You know, you need your vocals. You know, for, yeah, for yeah, a game you like that. Pull that shit out. But, but man, was I devastated. Hmm. Yeah, he's like, like I, I did what I could. It's Gen One. I got frozen. Couldn't thaw out because I don't have an ice heel, so I had to lose. And he just lost, and I was like, damn. In At least he only lost one. Huh? In a hard switch. Yeah, could have done that too, but I guess everybody else was weakened. That's, I think is what he said. Uh -huh. But either way, man, I was just, I was, I was upset a lot. Uh, I got when he first told me, and then when I first, when I finally got to talk to him face to face, I was fucking screaming at this guy. Um, and then, and then, and then we, you know, a week later we recorded an episode, and then I was fine. But still, Did you man, see the footage where he lost it? No, not yet, because that episode hasn't been edited yet at all. That's like gotcha. episode, oof, episode like 16, 17, I have no idea. Did, did you did you yell at him on camera? A little bit, yeah, because he brought it up again. And I was like, you know, DJ, I wasn't going to talk about it, but since you brought it up... So, oh, you know. fuck me. Yeah, it was, it, it, you know, it's a good time. I, you oh, know, I, I understand. Everybody makes mistakes. Everybody's human. By the way, I made it to the next town, so I don't know what you want to do, but made it to the um, next town. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm about to body this Togetic real quick. So here's what we can do if you're down, right? Because it, it, I think... I think we need to do a mass, a mass grinding. Word. Because, like, I don't know about you. I have, like, four fully evolved Pokemon, and that's it. Jesus, man. That's it. I don't so, know like, I, like... I, th I generally think it might be time for a grinding stream. Yeah? I think if we line it up correctly, we can do a grinding stream, like, the in-between time between the last episode and... Or this episode... Like we like yeah we could do we could definitely do a grinding like we can do a grinding stream after episode ten gets mm -hmm. aired, and then they see episode eleven, and then they'll see episode twelve with our new fresh new team. I think that's what we should do. Otherwise, we could also do it off screen. Like I'm not opposed to doing that either. But mm -hmm. I, I, I'd like to hang out with you on stream again. I haven't done that with you in a while. Shit, we ain't done that since Isle of Armor dropped. Exactly, the Isle of Armor drop, right? You ain't Bro, wrong me when you right. were there. I, I, it's crazy because me and you both got off work at the same freaking time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And like, Downloaded it straight away. What's up with this? Yes, sir. Shit was crazy. It was a good time. Crown Tundra definitely was has a better place in my heart because of the whole, you know, 300 sub breakage yeah. and just somehow just getting like overloaded with viewers that I never knew existed. I lost a lot of those subs, but you know, kept a few of them too. So it is what it is. But it's it hey, still man. a good time. Had a really if, fun time. If, if I had every subscriber from one of my videos. I would have like fucking forty. 40 no, that fake. Subs. No, that fake ass video you made about um, <laughs> ab about about um. No, no, you you killed him. That fake ass video you made about turning on your shiny charm. If <laughs> yeah. you would have got even just like, uh, like uh, one percent of those of those to sub to you, you'd have had mm -hmm. like a, a, a thousand subscribers. <laughs> well, I have that one video, man. That's got over fifty thousand views. Yeah, isn't isn't that that one video that I'm talking no, about? No, bro, that's the the Moonstone video. Uh, okay, okay. Well, yeah, either way, all I'm saying is like, yeah, yeah. I don't know if there you said it, is, it in, the, in the intro of those Evolution. videos to like and subscribe, but you should have. Definitely, man. If you, yeah, we're gonna. I guess we're gonna go ahead. I just got a final evolution there, which is awesome. Did you make um, it into the town? Not yet, my man. Not yet. Um, I'm almost there. Uh, I wanted to hit that up real quick. But yeah, I think we're gonna end the episode off here. If Q's got anything else, you got anything else to add, Q? Um, y'all, the next episode is gonna be fucking wild because it's it's the six v six. Yeah, it's the we're 6v6. gonna. We might be doing a grinding sesh or doing off screen grinding sesh with the recording. Yeah. If you it if you guys ends. if you guys haven't seen a stream yet at the time mm -hmm. of this going up, then we're most likely did it off screen. Gotcha. And we're just gonna we're just gonna you know scouts honor and stuff like that. If you lose them on, you know what I mean. Obviously, you should tell the other person, but, you know I mean? If you choose to lie, that's your opinion. That's your Ooh, choice. But I, I 100% will be genuine. I'm a man of my word. I only lie on camera. Only on camera. You son of a bitch. <laughs> Shout out to episode six and five, I think. <laughs> five and six. But, yeah, man. Or six and seven. I don't remember. But, yeah, that's going to be it. I thought this was my video. Never mind. No, it's not. Go ahead. Nope. Take it away, Phantom. <laughs> All right, you guys. If you guys did enjoy this, please smash the like button. Support is always greatly appreciated. If you guys do not want to miss a single episode of The Warlock, please go over to Q the Costa Ricans channel and subscribe to my main man. But with that, everybody, I have been the Phantom Michael. That's Q. We're going to get the hell out of here, and we will see you guys in the next one. Burnt Snake! You damn right.